I hit my head. I'm floating. Hello friends, it's me. And if you follow me on Instagram, you know my pictures kind of suck. Over time, you can see my evolution of trying to make my photos better. I mean, some of the last pics I took, I'm very proud, okay? But today, we're gonna be stepping up our game and trying out some photo hacks to make your pics look better. Wow, she got roasted right here. She's like, hello friends, take a photo of me. <laughs> no curves. <laughs> Rude. Excuse me, I have feelings. Oh, bring out your inner Insta thought. Yes, that's how you do it. See, everyone on Instagram can just pose and look like this. But it's like, if you see them in real life, most of them are gonna look like this. I mean, you don't see people in real life looking like this. It's posing, it's angles. It looks good on Instagram. <laughs> That's how my pictures go. Hey, I'm sitting on a bench and I have some coffee. Hola, is she drinking hot coffee with a straw? A plastic straw? Ashley, what are you doing? It looks like it's 90 degrees outside and you drink a hot coffee. Not very visco of you. This is me, my aesthetic, and sucking at taking pics. Oh, so she put her legs out to make them look longer. That's what we're getting at here because apparently Instagram doesn't like short legs. I for a while now and let me tell you it greatly improves your photos like how you pose so this is one of the first Instagram tricks I learned so it's like you take a picture like this or you take it like this so it's like look this versus this don't my legs look so much longer they look longer do they not this video is over <laughs> how many takes she had to do to get this one right or maybe you have to like mark it on the ground to make it look like you're walking on the coke can see these are like illusions so you can put like any drink not sponsored by coke okay now I want to try it so I'm gonna get some rocks to mark where I have to go so where's the first can here Four little done first can here we go we marked the spot next can keep going a little stop next can the last can No, not my Kyle power. Oh no. She's floating. Did you see that? Did you see those toes? They lifted off the air for a sec. Wow, 2019. We fake floating for likes. So she tied her shoelaces together. So she just like lifts off of one foot to make it look like she's floating. Okay, you know what? This is pretty cool. I'm gonna try it out. I took some tennis shoes and I tied them. I guess this only works with tennis shoes. I don't think I tied them good enough. So we're gonna, actually we should probably put them on first. And then you wanna tie them really tight. Oh wait, we're not gonna put that one on. So basically you got a unishoe. Two shoes in one. Okay, so this is gonna be a perspective type pick. You wanna take it from a low angle. Are you I getting- I see your other foot. Oh no! Oh yeah, this is good. Okay. <gasps> I'm floating. Hey, you wanna see a really cool trick? <gasps> I believe I can fly. Okay, there's like a few frames. You know, that's all you really need, just a few frames. Hold on, you can see my foot. Maybe it's because I have some big old feet. I'm gonna try putting my foot to the side like this. I got some long toes and they like to mm, stick out. <gasps> I'm floating. How to take a not average pool photo. Oh, she put it in the water with her foot. Oh, that's cool. You could get underwater pics or like half underwater and half air. Wow. Oh, I remember Kendall Jenner did a version of this. Okay, step one, have very long, luscious, healthy hair. Step two, have a friend style it. Wait, first you need to have a friend that you're okay with touching your hair. Wow, she got up and moved. Oh my God, all of that for a boomerang. I, I think it came out pretty nice. Like it's a pretty photo and then when you get up and like reverse it, the effect looks, mm, all right. I'm gonna rate this one a six out of 10 because I'm not super impressed. I 
wondered how people do that. I thought they like added in the finger and the effects later. But I guess they were filming it all at once. Oh, that's gonna take so much synchronizing. You're gonna need a friend that you can like really sync with. Cause I feel like this would be a disaster. Like you ain't gonna be in the same spot. The finger isn't gonna like touch. I don't know. And then you have to like record it all at the same time as you're doing it. The person really has to like synchronize with you. I think this is a level two photo hack. We should have a level one. I haven't played with one of these in a long time. I hit my head. I ordered this off Amazon and look how big it is. I was expecting a tiny slinky and it's like, look. Okay, so basically we wanna like take a picture inside the slinky. So babe, you're gonna grab it and then put the camera inside. It's cool, huh? Keep your slinky steady. I can't imagine this to actually look good. Okay, some of these shots actually look decent-ish. Taking a picture of a human looks acceptable. What is this voodoo magic? You use your dirty laundry carrier to make all these crazy shadows. Okay, you know what? I'm, I'm not very impressed with this one. There's nothing crazy. This ain't gonna make your pictures viral, okay? <laughs> okay, so that's how you do it. I've seen TikToks of this. So they just drop their phone on the ground and then drop it again. But this time reverse the other clip of you wearing something else. Now I know the way. What? So basically they take the phone and then they, mm, mm, in the face. But then you have to edit it, so you just transition to something else. Okay. So you got all your homies posing in the back, and you got some new shoes that you really want to show off. <laughs> so it's just a perspective photo. Making the shoes look ginormous. The ultimate flex. Drip so heavy, all my girls gotta hold it up. Man, get you friends like this. That will take bomb AF perspective photos. It doesn't get any more aesthetic than that drip of coke coming onto Ashley's hands. I give this one a big fat nice. Nine out of 10 would like. They put ice on their table. Oh, I've never seen this done before. <gasps> wow. People will be like, why are you in an ice box though? <laughs> I am the true Queen Elsa. Or is she a princess? Princess Elsa. Not queen. She ain't up there yet. This next one, I've seen people do it on TikTok. I'm like, how do you do that? And then I watched the tutorial. So I already know how to do this. This is just such a like easy, cool thing because there's gonna be at least one person that watches it and is like, oh, how'd she do that? How'd she change the filter just like that? What? This must have required immense editing and skill for a story of this caliber. But no, it's so easy. So you just literally record yourself doing like this and then record the screen while you're swiping through filters. That's how you do it. That's pretty genius. And there's probably a lot more you can do with that little knowledge. Filter, be gone. Okay, so the trick is to crop this hand out. So you're reaching into another dimension. Take the filter and swipe it. I think I did that one pretty good. So we're gonna put it in Instagram and I'm going to record the screen and then just, I have to time it. Oh no, I did it wrong. This is what the final product looked like. <laughs> oh! But this whole time I've been texting a sea urchin. The bath has revealed her final form. Man, if there was actually a dude like this, I would smack Ooh. him. Like what you expect. I don't want you to see my dirty bath water. Wow. <laughs> 
All right, you need three people for this. Or I wonder if I can do it myself because the way panorama works, like, hmm. Oh, I like this idea. It's like, oh, stop right there. It honestly looks Photoshop, but it's not. Today, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I had so much fun trying these. And if you guys enjoyed and want more videos like this, make sure you hit that like button in the face. And make sure you turn on notifications. Click, click, and subscribe to my channel. I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.